All right, what's up, guys? I'm gonna rip these seven packs of 2022 Bowman NPB. This is the first Japanese Bowman set, which is pretty fun. Uh, I, of course, had to open one off camera when I got the box. So this was our pull from that first pack. This is a uh, Hikaru Yamashita yellow parallel, numbered to 150. Pretty cool. And then there were a couple of couple of chromes in that first pack as well, so cool stuff. I am not in focus here, am I? I think that's good. Alright, let's get to it. Oh, let's just check that. Yellow parallel was... I believe that was a gold, so gold is 1 in 60. Cool. Making sure we're in focus before I start going to these. Here's our first chrome. One name rookie, that's cool. And oh, that's cool. Wow, numbered to 75, Ray Sakata, that's Bowman first, pink parallel. Very cool pull. So we're two for two on pulls so far in these first two packs. Let's sleeve this guy up. Yeah, pull number two, Ray Sakata on the carp first and let's look on the second pack let's see base card parallel fuchsia that's one in 40. very cool okay fun uh fun group of packs so far Munitaka Murakami, hell yeah, that's awesome. So those, if any of you guys aren't familiar with him, he broke the record for home runs by a Japanese-born player this past year. Um, and his base cards have been going for a really good amount of money. And um, it actually just came out that he is going to post, I believe, after the 2025 season. So he'd be coming to the majors in 2026. Um, so that is going right in a sleeve. I pulled a base card of his from the Topps NPB Chrome 2021, I believe. Um, and that's very cool. There was, his base cards were briefly going for like upwards of $50 when they, <laughs> before anybody had bought the boxes, but that was short lived, but he is a heck of a player and it's exciting that he is now all but confirmed coming to the majors in a few years. All right, let's see who else we got in this pack. I've mentioned this before, but it's so fun. These cards are so fun because they give you guys to pay attention to for, like, years, you know? I mean, I guess the same as, as Bowman with uh, American players, but really enjoy having a reason to watch these particular NPB players. All right, so no parallel in that one, but, you know... Um, I don't really care because I'm just as stoked to pull a... Murakami as I would be to pull a numbered parallel, to be honest. Whether or not that makes, uh, whether or not the numbers add up on that. <laughs> Super stoked either way. All right. This is our fourth pack. Definitely some names I recognize in here. Guys who we've pulled from the other NPB packs. Roki Sasaki, wow, all right. So you guys are probably familiar with him. He threw a perfect game last season. Um, he's like 22 years old or something. He's super young. Uh, unclear if or when he'll come over to the majors, but it won't be anytime soon. Regardless, that's really exciting 
really fun card to pull. I've got his base cards across uh, Chrome and NPB the last couple of years, but that's that's super fun. That is Sasaki's first Bowman card. Not a Bowman first, but his first Bowman. So pretty cool to pull. M Murakami, I'm gonna try to get this in focus. Pretty cool to pull Murakami and Sasaki back-to-back -back packs. Super fun. Those are definitely, uh, those are going in the binder for sure. All right, get through the rest of this pack now. Koki Kato, I, I recognize his name. And the bright, that's a weird photo. I actually really like that. He's like way over there. <laughs> oh, that's fun. Narichika Aoki, if we, you guys probably remember him from his uh, his stint in the majors. This is one of the one of the inserts in the set. That's a cool card. I think I, I mentioned this in the last uh, unboxing I did, but um, there's like, there's a weird market for X MLB guys who are in MPB. There's like definitely uh, those cards seem to sell, which is interesting. All right, we have four packs to go. So far, my review on these is that they have been extremely worth the purchase. I opened half of the packs that I purchased and I've pulled two of the two of the players I'm chasing and two numbered parallels. So that's really cool. Not to mention the Chrome cards. All right, making sure we're in focus. Here's another Aoki card that's kind of fun. Set that aside. Nothing too crazy in that one, but always fun to get those chrome cards. So yeah, every pack seems to have two two chromes, and then a couple of these have had a numbered parallel. It's fun to get those chromes in every pack. I'm actually not a big Bowman guy normally, but first uh, NPV Bowman set, I obviously had to had to partake. Actually, I recognize Koga's name, so I don't know if he's somebody I should know, but it's really a name I've heard, I just don't really know much about him as a player. And like I said, I feel like that's part of the fun of these cards is getting to figure out who these guys are later on. Because I had no idea who Murakami was when I pulled the card. Oh, speak of the devil. Wow, isn't that funny? It's literally just mentioning. I didn't know who this guy was, and then he went and hit like 60 home runs, or whatever it was. Set the record for a Japanese-born player in the MPB. Two Murakamis out of this, uh, two Murakamis in, in eight packs is pretty awesome. This one has a little ding on the corner, but I'm not really gonna worry about it. Awesome pull. So we now have two Murakamis and a Roki Sasaki. That's pretty fun. You know what this is? Let's see. Masashi Ito, number to one ninety nine. Very cool. Very, very cool. leave that guy up. That is our third numbered parallel. I'm just grabbing the highlights so far. So we've got these three in the blue. Okay, so obviously the fuchsia is the rarest of those. 
and very cool dual Murakamis. Last pack. Thanks for watching. To everybody who uh, participated in this box share, thank you guys. I wouldn't have uh, wouldn't have bought a box without <laughs> having uh, friends to share it with. So thanks to everybody who uh, who ordered. Let's do this last pack. Really can't even be mad if there's nothing exciting in this one because we got so much good stuff already. Apologies for the uh, dishwasher sounds. <laughs> Oh, cool to get a couple of chrome Bowman firsts there. So, really good. Really, uh, really fun. Like we said, we have three numbered parallels pulled. And two more Akamis. And Roki Sasaki. Pretty good haul for eight packs, not to mention the various uh, various chrome cards in the insert. So, good stuff. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, enjoy your cards.